Hello, people of the internet. Welcome to my channel, or welcome back if you've been here before. As you read from the title up there, I am doing a summer slash summer haul, I guess is what we're calling this. Um, I did not just go out and order a ton of stuff just so I could do this. I was going to do some shopping anyways, and I decided to film a video once I had somebody just like my photo on Instagram. I decided to wait until I had a nice accumulation of things, and I do now. Not gonna lie, I kind of forgot about it, and I've done a lot of shopping. I'm going to show you what I got, tell you where it's from, and I'm gonna try it on for you. What I will not be doing is linking everything that I bought in the description because it's from quite a few different stores. Um, I discovered the beauty of online shopping recently, and I can shop without leaving my house or even leaving my bed, and it's fantastic. If you want to go find it, just go to the website, type in the things. Sorry about your life. So starting on top of my head, I bought myself another snapback because I have one Joker snapback that I wear literally all the time, but I kind of get bored of wearing the same one over and over again. You feel me? And I can't be bothered to do my hair every day either because that's just not negotiable. So I decided to get another one and I was going to get one that wasn't Joker themed, oh, but then I found this and like there's nothing more perfect. And I wear mine backwards and this guy matches my hair. So if I wear it backwards, you see the cool paneling. If I wear it forwards, you see this. Either way you do it, it's fantastic and I love it. Moving on. I could sit here and talk about a hat all day. Oh, by the way, that hat was off of Amazon. Okay, I'm divided. Crap. I just spilled an entire cup of water and I will be right back. Went all the way upstairs for a cup of water from our filter and then I spilled it in the floor. So I just refilled it with water from the tap and now my water tastes like organ. All right, so first things first, I am so, so hard on my tights and I break them so easily. Tights with holes in them are cute and they fit the aesthetic, but when you have like a lot of holes in them and it's, it doesn't look intentional anymore and then you shove your foot through one of the holes and it rips them completely and then you have like a leg and a half, then you need a new pair. So I got a new pair. It's just black tights. Not much to say about them. They are about that see-through when you have your leg in them, or at least mine. Um, I got them from Forever 21. There's a dog hair from Loki. They are not super, super sheer, but they're not super black, which I like. They're nice middle ground. Um, yeah, Forever 21 for like five bucks, and you got yourself a pair of tights, and you only spent five bucks on them, so if you break them, and then you can just replace them and not be mad. I also picked up a pair of fishnets because the ones I had before also got a ton of holes in them. But they were the thinner fishnets, so they were like super tiny diamonds. And from a far away, from a far away, from far away it just looked like I was wearing tights, which isn't the point of fishnets. So I bought this pair from Forever 21 as well. And these guys have much larger much larger um, diamondy dudes, and it doesn't have that weird sheer part at the top. So if you wanted to wear it with shorts and like pull them out of the top of your shorts a little bit and have the band showing, you could. I ain't gonna do that because that's just not for me. But yeah, I like these, and they also have the um, where are they? The little toe things at the end, so your toes don't go straight through the holes. Um, because I've had that happen to me as well. I also got a pair of black knee-high socks that say Tokyo because I am such a weeb that I have to have a pair of Tokyo socks. I'm not going to unroll them right now because I don't feel like it, but you'll see them in the try-on haul. They're about knee, right under the knee, um, and they're just black. They don't have any pattern or anything on them. They just have, I can't, I can't see if you can tell. 
they just have that black like vertical stripe on them but it's nothing like too prominent they're like oh you're wearing stripey socks it's pair of plain socks with Tokyo on the back. I thought it was on the front when I bought them and then I learned it was on the back and I was upset for a while. Then I put them on and I think it looks better on the back anyways. So yeah. Also Forever 21 because I've done a lot of shopping there lately. So I got on Romwe for the first time and First off the bat, a lot of options, a lot of different styles, not a lot for my style because I'm more alternative. Stumbled upon the men's pajamas section and I found myself a set. It's this right here. These are the shorts. Just regular, here, let me back up. Just regular shorts. Uh, the back has a fake pocket, which is real dumb, but it has actual pockets in the front and you'll see in the try on they're so deep i freaking love these they are so comfortable they come down to my knees i can pull them up a little on my waist and i'm not gonna be super short because they're actual shorts um and i love them so they also came with a matching t-shirt which is frankly because it was in my drawer but it's just a plain t-shirt it's kind of long it has a little pocket on the front that matches the pants that i think is adorable and the shirt is a little oversized on me because I'm not a man. Okay, so I was on the hunt for a swimsuit. I found one. I found one that I liked and I ordered, and it is the sky. Well, it's backwards. It's this guy. It is a board shirt. Is that what they call it? Like the wetsuit material almost, but it's a shirt and it's snake print, and you can't go wrong with snake print, and it's a crop top, and it ties in the front right here, and I love it so much. It came with padding in the front and I took that out and I just wear a sports bra under it because it looks dumb. Just trust me, it looks dumb. It also came as a set with a very uh, skimpy looking bottom half, so I'm gonna wear my shorts with it. Next is something not from Wamwe. Wamwe, Wamwe. All right. So we're taking a break from Romwe for a moment to kick off over our water again. Um, because I found this at, where was I at? Fred Meyers. I was at Fred Meyers and I found this. And it's just, upon first glance, a black tank top. But it's got that thing where it's short in the side and then it swoops down in front and in back, which is super cute. The arms are not super tight up under your armpit so it doesn't like cut off your circulation. It's the material super soft and it's almost spandexy, but I don't know what it is. It drapes really nicely. And then you can tuck one side under your belt in your jeans and it drapes very nice. It's dirty so it's a little wrinkly. Um, because I already wore it like a million times because it's fantastic. Back to Forever 21. I picked this shirt up a while ago, but I wanted to show it anyways because it's a very good summer shirt and it is my favorite. That tank top I just showed you and this shirt I'm about to show you are my two favorite shirts and I will wear them all summer, all summer. It's from the athletic part of Forever 21, like their activewear section. So it is this muscle tank. It comes down really, really low in the sides and in the back is like completely open. It's longer in the back and shorter in the front. It's made of the same kind of material as that other shirt, but a little bit more cottony. Um, and I freaking love it so much. I don't know why I like muscle tanks so much right now.
Um, and then back to Romwe because I did a lot of shopping on there. So I was looking for a mesh shirt um, and I wasn't paying attention. Do that when you're shopping online, pay attention to what you're buying. Um, but I wanted a mesh tank top and I found one and it's this guy. And isn't it cute? Except I didn't know that this panel was here. I thought it was all mesh and that they were wearing some kind of sports bra underneath. But no, it's, it's, it's in there. Also, I bought it a size too small. I do like how it's cuffed at the sides so it's not just that raw hem that some shirts have and the same at the bottom. And I don't hate the panel. I actually don't hate it, but I find hard, I have a hard time finding things to wear with it other than this other statement piece that I'm going to show you in a minute. Um, but yeah, I don't hate it and I found a good use for it. So not mad. A very hard time finding shorts um, so when I went on Walmart and I found these I immediately bought them they are high-waisted and they are lower cut and they have stuff on them because I wore them to work don't worry I'm not disgusting I just wore them yesterday um, so yeah they're just regular shorts they're high-waisted they have big pockets on the back they have pockets in the front. They're super small, so they barely even matter, but they're there. They are there. Um, I do like the belt loops. They don't stop here like some do. They come down farther, so I can actually fit my studded belt on these. And I'll show you that in the try-on haul because my studded belt doesn't fit in a lot of pants and shorts because it's three like stacks of the studs and my other one I have another that's black and it has two rows um, and that one fits better but it's not as shiny and I like the shiny one moving on the statement piece I was talking about earlier is this it's these from Hot Topic I freaking love Hot Topic. I will always love Hot Topic. And a lot of their stuff is like, okay, you're kind of nerdy now. But this, this is amazing. I freaking love these. And I will find any opportunity to wear them except to work because I do not want to destroy them because I love them. They are just red plaid. They are such a bam in your face statement piece. And for someone who wears a lot of black, Having this and an otherwise all black outfit just is like in your face. Hello, I am here. So they are not high waisted, but they do have a higher waist. They have pockets in the front and the pockets are decently sized. The pockets in the back are kind of small. Um, they do have belt loops and it does fit my belt, my giant belt in there, which I'm very, very fond of. It doesn't crisscross in the back, but it does that kind of number and I'm quite a fan. The material is nice. Um, and then the hardware is um, a gray silver. So it's not bright silver, it's more of a gray tone. You can see it in contrast with my, um, my septum. This is a lot more gray tone, black tone. It's not as shiny is what I'm saying. And it matches everything else a lot better. So it's not so in your face because the rest of it's in your face. So if the hardware was in your face and this was in your face, that'd be a little bit too much. Um, I have another thing from Romwe and it is this. This is something I usually wouldn't buy. But I thought it'd be cute for like on the boat and stuff because we are boat people. It's this mesh cardigan and it's super long. It's super long um, and it's very flowy. It's half sleeve and then it flares out and then the trim flares out as well and it's super sheer. 
as I am sitting here talking about how great this is, a hole was found. I don't know if I made that or if that was there already, but um, it's very thin material. It wasn't expensive, so I'm not mad, but very thin, so be careful with this. Apparently, wasn't aware of that, but yes, I do like it. Other than the seam going down the whole back, I think that's a little annoying, but other than that, Our last article of clothing is a dress. Take that in for a second. A dress. I bought a dress and I do plan to wear it. I haven't worn it yet, but I do plan to wear it if I ever go on like a date or something. It was marked as a trip dress, but I don't know how trip this is, but I freaking love it. Um, I have another dress, this is from Hot Topic by the way, I have another dress from Hot Topic that's the same material and it's got lace sleeves and it's got this buckle that cinches in your waist and it's gorgeous, it's a high-low dress and I love it. So when I saw that this was the same material I, and by the same brand, which is I think Dang Goodman or something like that, I was super excited because it's very pretty, very pretty up top. I love this, it is adjustable in the back. There's adjustable straps um, and then it's cinches in here like a high empire waist. Is that what it's called? Did I just do a thing? Um, and then I'll stand up. It is higher in the front and lower in the back and it goes almost all the way to the floor in the back and it's gorgeous and I love it so much. the last item I didn't purchase recently but I wanted to throw them in here because I am in love I am in love with these boots and I wear them I'm not kidding when people are like I wear things I wear this every single day no I wear these every single day at least four days a week since I got them in like February these are my docs and I got the cherry or like I don't remember exactly what it's called, but I freaking love these boots. I love them so much. I love the background on them. I love that they're like a punk staple. I love that I got the red, so it already looks kind of like it's fading. You can already see where my heels rub together, where this rubs on me. They already are very fitted to my foot because I've worn them so, 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 so much. And I straight laced them because I think that looks super super cool so they're laced up like that across instead of the the usual thing these are the original style i almost got the jadens because i'm short and i wanted a little bit of lift i love them and they're great and i wanted to include them even though they were not from this recent haul because i just w love them and like punk and doc go hand in hand it's just the thing everybody knows it Alright, and that is the entire haul. So thanks for watching. If you made it all the way to the end of this video, which is probably going to be really long, not going to apologize for the content. It's going to be really long. Um, thank you for watching the whole thing. Uh, don't forget to like if you want to, if you like the video. If you hate it, then just give it a dislike and be a troll. I don't care. Have a good day or a night or whatever, wherever in the world you are. And I'll see you in my next video. Peace. I decided for... What is this hair doing? Can you cooperate? We want it to look messy, but not like that messy. Not like I don't care messy. Just like, I care a little bit messy. Let's do shirts next. Let's get that hair out of my lipstick. Which is also a shirt. What? What the heck is that?
It's part of a weed. I don't know. I have a lot of stuff. Hold on. So I'm not tall, um, but so I'm gonna go. I'm gonna kind of. Uh. Wow. Be cute. I mean, I get the whole. What are they doing up there? Oh. Um...